Hey, what's up, guys? Brett Maverick here. We're in my little, like, hallway slash purging station. I've got a little uh, heat mat, clone heat mat thing. Uh, this isn't the regular hydro farm one. I don't know how hot that gets, but this one here, it, after being on for quite a long time, I mean, like this one, it's, it's only been on actually for not that long. See how it says it's about 118? Well, when you have the chamber on it pushing pressure down, it gets hotter. Just like the oil on the parchment, you know, the deepest, see how it's hotter? Over there, it's 130 or whatever. And with this on there and everything, after about an hour, it can get up to 200 under there. And the oil, with that, it'll get up to, you know, like 140. So you have to keep moving this around like every hour, which is fine. It's actually so hot that for clones, it comes with this grate that you set your uh, tray on top of. I'm not a fan of heating my trays. You just rather just keep the room that they're in at least 70 degrees and you're fine. Um, but this is a video I wanted to make um, because I'm wrong. Like as you saw in the title, um, I was wrong about something just because I went by you know what other people told me and stuff that I read. I read that water's boiling point in a full vacuum was um, 170 degrees because it's uh, 212 you know at full pressure and that was the people's reasoning for telling me that limonene which boils at 130 degrees they're saying it would boil around 105 or so this is more on uh, the Northwest Green Thumb Forum not necessarily Jameson it was just a lot of people on there telling me this um, not a lot, a few people, sorry. The people that told me the boiling temperatures and stuff brought that up. Brought the boiling temperature of water is about 170, 171 or something, I think they said. The boiling temperature of limonene was 130, so it would be boiling around 110 or 105 in a vacuum. Well, come to find out, I got a, well, I got a comment from someone saying water boils in a full vacuum, which I was thinking, you know, yeah, 171, but I was like, I know what he meant, I know what he meant at the temperatures I kept my oil and I thought he was wrong so I was like no dude it doesn't try it well I fucking try it you know for myself I have I'm able to so I did and I was shocked to find out that it did boil so if limonene does boil at 130 degrees even if we put oil in at room temp we're boiling it out I mean just going by that I mean look my water right here is 65 degrees if you think I'm just shining right through it we'll go over to my floor 69 go over to this ballast we'll set my water on this ballast, which is kind of a dumb thing to do, but um, see the ballast is 112, go over here to the water, still 65. So this does shine on water, if anyone's thinking it doesn't. Uh, here we are, vacuum, chamber's not warm, it's 71, the bottom, water's still 65. Now we're dealing with 65 degree water, it's only 33 degrees hotter than it's uh, freezing point okay we're nowhere near 212 we're about 27 28 now my gauge says I'm getting past 30, it says I'm getting to like 32, which is physically not possible. Like right now it says I'm at 30, which you really can't get to. Now it says I'm past 30, around 31. Uh, really when it says that I'm at a full vacuum. Like right now, once it stops I'm at a full vacuum at 29.5 or whatever. And as you can see that 65 degree water is boiling. This dude was right, I'll leave his name in the description. The dude. Um, Thumbs up to the dude. I mean, right on, guy. Um, you know, you were right. You fucking proved me wrong. Well, not necessarily proved me wrong. Well, you did, actually. You said something. Then I told you you were wrong. <laughs> so, technically, yeah. Just letting you know you're right. I was wrong. This shit does boil in there. Who's I was talking about with my uh, gauge? Past 30. See, normally, be right there. But it's all good water is fucking oh it just calmed down now oh i know what it is never mind never mind the fucking butane guys you remember when i was dripping the water on my um griddle and making it splatter because the butane in it right now i'm just purging the butane out 
No, I'm just kidding. All right, um, that's that. I just wanted to show you. The dude was right. Whether it's boiling or just doing something, maybe I'm pulling some minerals out. Maybe it wasn't boiling. Someone might let me know in the comments. Remember, I'm not a scientist. I never claim to be. I always get a kick out of people claiming they're scientists. So, all right. I'll talk to you later.